Lichenometry is the use of lichens in dating substrate. There is a direct relationship between size and age of lichen. Researchers have used lichens to date slope deposits and debris flow. The assumption is made that there is no major time lapse between surface exposure and colonization. Rhizocarbon geographicum, the yellow green map like lichen, can grow for thousands of years and is often used. Researchers have dated lichens up to 500 years and they have been used in glacier recession dating. The maximum diameter of the largest lichen is first established for surfaces of known age, for example gravestones or buildings, in order to calibrate the growth curve of diameter v time. After calibrating a growth curve, the next step is to find similar lichens growing on substrate for exposure to be dated. You should record your data in a table like this one. You should first note down the date, location and a brief description of the lichen. You should be able to identify the lichen name. In this instance, it's Rhizocarbon geographicum. You should also note down the type of substrate. It is also important to take down the aspect using a compass. You then need to measure the maximum diameter of the five largest lichens. When choosing lichens to measure, it's important not to measure a cluster of lichens as one. It's a good idea to take a photograph of the lichens with a scale marker, for example a ruler, as seen here. You then need to plot a lichen growth curve. You will need to plot the mean maximum diameter against the date of substrate exposure at given locations. You should then draw a growth curve through the largest diameters. Lichenometry is not, however, without its limitations. For example, the unknown lapse rate between exposure and colonizations. And sometimes researchers can measure lichens that were already on the rock prior to further exposure. In addition, clusters of lichens are sometimes measured as one. Despite these limitations, lichenometry is a fairly accurate method of dating substrate. The accuracy of lichenometry is further improved when used in conjunction with dendrochronology, more commonly known as tree ring dating.